conversation continues with Bethany, Real Housewives of New York City. The jeans are going tremendously great. The right? jeans are going really well, yeah. That's and I great. like it. I like it. They're, I like also describing the skinny girl as more of a state of mind and unleashing in all sizes than That's... being stuck to the word skinny. Yes. And it also, the brand was created so many years ago, 10 years ago. I got to tell you, you also were the first person to put skinny on a grand, on a brand. On I mean, any brand. Now on everywhere brand. you go, now skinny. Everything is skinny. Well, yeah. That did not exist. No. Then 10 the girls on ago. Beverly Hills, skinny margarita, cheese, yes. you know, all of it. Skinny but by pizza, the way, but everybody. Latte. Well, anytime I go to dinner and anyone orders a margarita, they say a skinny margarita. I know. No sugar. I know. The, I mean. I know. It's amazing to be it part is of amazing. alcoholic it history. Is it is. It is. Yeah. But branding history because it's on everything else. I know, it's nice. Yes, it's good. Lady Bunny's documentary is called Wig. It's on HBO and HBO platforms. Okay, we gotta run through some more calls. Ashley from South Carolina for Bethany Frankel. What's your question? Hi, Andy. Hi, Bethany. Hey. My question is, what do you think of the rumor that Tinsley is dating Billy Bush, and do you think she had an agreement with Scott? Well, first of all, I think you should be doing phone sex. <laughs> And second of all, I think that that was a little bit of just like a PR thing. You know, I don't think that that, that they were really together hanging out. They Probably were just a little flirt. Somewhere. He's a canoodler, and yeah. so is she. So there was a little flirt. Um, and I do not, I don't know about like a deal with Scott. I don't think that she had a deal with Scott. I think that it's been back and forth and up and down. And I just think she has more of like a gag order from Scott. All right. Allie from Toronto. Hey, Allie, what's your question? Hi, Andy. Happy belated Father's Day. Thank you. Oh, it's such a special one, the first one. Thanks. Uh, my question, yeah, it really is. And, and, and Andy, you share Ben with us, and it's just, we're so grateful. He brings Thanks. such joy on Instagram. Uh, no, truly. Um, hi, and Bethany, such a fan. I admire everything you say and everything you do. Just so bright and so witty. Thank Love you. it all. Thank you. Thank you. Um, so clearly, clearly the one was not getting it when you went up to the bedroom in such friendship. You're being such a good friend, Lou, like, come on, everyone's getting so frustrated. She just didn't get it. What do, what do you think? What more could you have said? It's so actually it true point. what you're saying. Well, you also said I'm not gonna. I'm not. I'm not talking with you. I'm talking at you. No, I, mean, I said. Well, it's so funny you said that because someone stopped me on the street the other day. Someone that I'm friends with, yeah. and I've heard this from many people. They said now the way that I handle things is they walk into meetings. I'm not here to listen. I'm here to talk. Yeah, right. Here, right. Right. Well, yes. so yeah, but it was. It was time. Right. You know, sometimes you get. You could be fed anything, pizza, chocolate, cabaret, to the point where you throw up. Yes, right. You know how they force feed those yes. with the geese or something for the yes. foie gras? They yes. duck fat. Like, yes. then you throw it up. Yes. So I threw up all over Luann. Yeah. I all threw right. Luann up all over yes, Luann. You did. Let's go to Alicia from Philly. Hey there. What's your question? Hey, my question is for Bethany. Okay, so after Miami, do you think Barbara Kay fully integrated herself into the group? Mm, nah. Let's go to Ricky from South Carolina. Last call of the night. Hey, Ricky. Hey, Andy. Hey, man. Oh, yeah, Andy. I love these voices today. I do, too. <laughs> Got like a whole thing going. I, I love Bravo, love the Housewives, but my question is for Bethany. Okay. Be Bethany, in your opinion, do you think Ramona was breaking girl code by making out with Harry Dubin? And do you see her and Mario getting back together? Whose girl code? Every single vagina in Manhattan? I don't even know what code. Like, who's she, she's, you know what I mean? And one, yeah, yeah. I mean, when you've, when you've banged four out of nine housewives, right. it's a free game. You know what I mean? I don't know what to tell you. Wait, Ramona, Ramona Luann, Sonia, Sonia. Gwen Kelly. Oh, right. Wow. Yeah. That's, that's, <laughs> that, that makes, uh, oh, and Aviva. Five. Yes. Oh my God. What's what's the record? Slade. How many has he Slade been? Slade was three. So forget Gretchen, Harry Dubin. Joe and Lori. I want to see it. How? What does it look like? <laughs> How, what, what does it look like? Is it chrome? Is it a chrome plated cock? What does it look like? The fuck does this thing look like? I want to thank Bethany Frankel and Lady Bunny for more clicking on BravoTV.com tonight, everybody. Thanks for watching. Watch more clips here and subscribe to our channel here. See ya.